welcome to Anish for you and you watching uh, this particular build uh, it is a aircraft build like previous one um, so it is not a spaceship it is um, not spaceship means it is not inspired by my different spaceship genre it is a simple um, aeroplane and that is what I trying to do uh, I already create two uh, jet um, in this game and uh, this is a slightly different types of uh, types of um, shape and size and form factor so this is a 10 uh, one of my favorite looking uh, uh, attacking attacking aircraft so I try to make it blow up its size and make it huge and uh, very big as you can see there is some some similarities between them but I took that um, took that form obviously uh, the main shape I uh, main shape I saw it is on some reddit post uh, but I, I didn't get that total or full view mm, I know it is a greenish looking a big uh, modified ship not means it is a glitch ship but uh, I don't remember the post where it is I didn't find any uh, find it uh, letter wise and a uh, letter time so I had to make it all my own but I obviously copy the uh, copy the design type and I am a very big sucker for uh, aircraft and airplane or um, any fighting jet or something like that so uh, that's the reason to build this huge humongous three tire um, ship obviously you don't need to make it this big um, I make it this big just because I like uh, big ship um, especially the USSR my ships are huge and I like that kind of vibe so that's the reason I uh, built this particular ship so uh, today we are not going to do the uh, do the easy way just create a ship from uh, scratch we're going to do the different way because uh, um, it is far more easy to show you what it contains uh, so I don't have to uh, change different parts here and there and it will confuse you uh, so you can easily see these parts are e easily available on your base so almost all parts are available on your base so no need to worry about that and there is some um, uh, some actual actual component actual record component uh, as you can see there is a uh, lots of um, lots of landing uh, landing gear there so I delete it it is obviously as your choice you can put it um, you have to put it means you can put it easily as your um, as uh, as you see fit but I'm not going to show you what you need for decoration purposes what you need is that engine here and then engine upstairs so there is two engine and uh, you have to put it like that so it is slightly uh, slightly backwards uh, so by cover it up you have to use uh, a demos uh, part you can is easily use the demos part but I use a smaller uh, cargo hold and uh, this actually works very well and it actually looks like a flipper uh, the plane or the uh, the wing hand so there is two cargo hold inside to uh, make it looks like um, uh, th this is a big one what I placed here this is a bigger one and then uh, there is these very 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 low capacity fuel tank just to make it uh, looks like a bomb or something like that so this is only for decoration purpose you can easily skip it mm, or you can easily change it with something else uh, if you place rocket holder or something like that you can easily do that here and uh, th there is a second um, uh, ca third cargo hold in the wing uh, so two small cargo hold and one uh, 1200 cargo hold so there is already a huge quantity so as you can see the layout here 
uh, is very easy to build. Uh, most of my build are easy to build. Uh, otherwise, I am not going to build that. I don't want, wish to. Uh, I don't wish to spend like hundreds on hours to make a build. So I'm not going to do that. So. Uh, the main ship component is four tire, uh, the landing bay and uh, the landing uh, landing gear and all that. But other than that, the main hubs are three tiered. So for the cockpit, I use this particular cockpit because it is actually blended uh, together very well. You can easily use a slick cockpit uh, and that can also serve you um, uh, better. Um, it means uh, if you make it make a uh, slightly sick lo um, uh, slick looking plane you can easily do that it is very easy to uh, easy to alter my design or alter this particular design uh, so i make it three tier to just make it bulkier looking so may my main purpose to make it bulkier looking nothing else so that's the reason so there is a small hub and then you put your reactor, your uh, grab drive, and uh, your uh, fuel tank, main fuel tank. So, uh, so these are the uh, uh, these are the main requirement. So there's go the side mounted um, shield. So what I need uh, now is a grab drive uh, from him and uh, last of all this particular model had this particular uh, particular uh, fuel tank it's actually quite capable fuel tank it easily be placed here and there and it's also been attached uh, uh, from any direction so it is really nice this particular fuel tank and there is two cargo hold to make it slightly wing shaped cargo hold there and now we're going to uh, put the third tire of the hubs uh, you can totally skip that part and um, you can easily place it or you can easily choose some some other uh, type or some other uh, shape so there is three uh, so this is a total uh, 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 longitudinal form so uh, everything is uh, um, in between the in between like a sandwich it is already sandwiched the reactor hub and the fuel tank so it is quite easy to build up to this this portion now we're going to use that um, engine, Nova engine, and um, um, it is it can be attached just up, to, uh, just um, uh, just up of the um, uh, okay. Oh, sorry. Uh, so I have to put another piece of um, another piece of. You can easily delete those search and equipment bay that is required for attaching a weapon. So uh, don't forget about it. Uh, you need a, a equipment bay and um, to attach uh, uh, weapons here. And now I think okay. So. you make it down one part uh, actually i always use these uh, uh, use use uh, um, use any part i find here and there and uh, make different shapes so you can easily if you don't have that particular uh, braces bracers you can easily that one also that is uh, that is available on your uh, on your um, base so you can easily do that and uh, now we're going to use that particular piece uh, to mount the weapon you can also do it normal way you can easily put it like that and um, put it uh, upward and uh, you can attach weapons there but it actually looks um, better I, th I think uh, so if you if you wish to change it you can change it 
so the um, this part i can delete it right now so now all we have to do is just uh, place those pieces uh, it's only for decoration purposes nothing else uh, only to make it look good uh, so that's the build actually nothing else so that's the build you can just put some um, landing gears and all that and you, your build is complete so it is quite easy build quite easy build you have to go uh, go for that look nothing else you just go for the look uh, and um, if you like this kind of uh, builds uh, I'm really I, I am always uh, a very big fan of uh, bulky bulky aircraft uh, because I love love USSR or Soviet Union's aircraft they are like huge humongous uh, aircraft I always like that and I always like that uh, attacking uh, attacking planes or attacking fighting jets and all that so I always trying to replicate those those particular types of uh, uh, particular types of stuff so the layout is uh, finally here uh, under the wing uh, there is a one two um, two storage place one engine one big storage place and a full tank so that is very easy layout you can just place it down like that and the main part is consists of this this wing part um, you can you can you can use the um, actual tail piece of domino uh, demos uh, tail piece you can also use that uh, and now that's it I, I think the there is nothing more uh, that's the build actually is quite quite and the docker is there and uh, if I forget to mention it earlier the docker is downstairs so it is attached also like belly wise it is attached uh, so these are the breakdowns um, hope you like it I like that breakdown and um, I don't wish to make it uh, thoroughly from ground up so I just uh, show you um, show this show this build uh, these reverse way so just disassemble everything right now and and the main hub setup is like that uh, and the engine uh, and the reactor and all that are like that so it's quite uh, quite sleek you can make it quite sleek if you use it underneath uh, the reactor and all that you can put it underneath and you can just uh, eliminate one full um, full tire or you can just make it single tire like you know, if you always need a very very compact looking but um, single tire it is not possible at least you need double tire if you need uh, the single tire uh, then you have to sacrifice the look slightly so that's the build uh, it is not uh, something very uh, very um, complicated the, you, you can easily adjust the weapons and all that I use totally automatic weapon uh, other than that uh, the things are same so that's it I think that's it uh, for this build uh, it is a E1 uh, E10 um, attacking aircraft so stay tuned for more